Bonjour French learners, it's Tavi Baisley here from French Stitch. In this video, I'm going to teach you six ways in how you're going to say I love you, I like you, or I care a lot about you. So I'll teach you how to say it, who to use it with, and also how to pronounce it so you feel comfortable saying it. Um, and you can practice here on the video. So the first one, the most traditional one, the one that's printed on all the t-shirts around the world. I love you. Je t'aime. Je t'aime. And what I added here is the text version. So J T M, the letters G T M are shorthand for je t'aime. So if you want to put it at the bottom of a text message or at the end of a text message, um, this is the one you use. Otherwise, this is the one you say. Je t'aime. Okay. The next one is Tu me plais vraiment. Tu me plais vraiment. What it means is I really like you. I really like you. I really fancy you. Vraiment is really and the verb plaire, which this is based on, is something is pleasing to someone. So you literally start by the person who's pleasing to you, you, is pleasing to me, as in I like you. Vraiment, if you want to add very much, a lot, really. This one I'm putting in for a bit of fun. I worship you. Je te vénère. Je te vénère. From the verb vénérer, to worship. Je te vénère could come a bit strong handed. You'll have to adjust depending on your audience. Je te vénère. This one, two options. Either masculine, je suis fou de toi, if you're ma male. If you're female, je suis folle de toi. I am crazy about you. Je suis fou de toi. Oh, je suis folle de toi. This one is quite romantic. Je ne pense qu'à toi. I can only think of you. I only think of you. Le jour et la nuit, day and night. Je ne pense qu'à toi. I can only think of you. I only think of you. I think that's quite romantic. Um, this one is... A bit different and I thought I'd add it in to teach you how to say I care a lot about you. Je tiens à toi. Je tiens à toi. It's a bit tricky to pronounce but if you know how to say the word dog, chien, you'll have seen that I-E-N, E-E-N together and we always pronounce it I-E-N. So je tiens à toi. Tiens comes from the verb tenir which means to hold. And here we're not saying that we're physically holding them or restraining them, because that would be a bit weird. We're saying that we hold onto them dearly. We care about them. So if you want to say that, je tiens à toi. So I said six, but I thought I'd add in a bonus one today. If you're being very romantic and today's the day you're going to propose, this is the question you're going to ask. Veux-tu m'épouser? I'm not looking for a husband, so don't comment below. With that, but this is the sentence you use if you want to propose to someone. Veux-tu m'épouser? Voilà, mes amis. They were some of the sentences that you can use to say that you love someone or you care someone. I will see you in the next video. But until then, please comment below and tell me which one you're going to use and with who. I love to see their names and then just say who you're going to, which sentence you're going to use for that person. Voilà, I'll see you in the next video. Au revoir.